Last week, I introduced our theme, Reclaiming the Power of the Rosary. Today, I'd like to talk about the rosary as a spiritual tool capable of calming our worries and anxieties. But first, I need my fidget toys for a few minutes. Fidget toys, stress balls, and similar gadgets most likely have their roots in Chinese medicine balls, which were created in the 14th century. These small decorated balls, which come in pairs, were designed to be manipulated in your hands to relieve stress and anxiety. They're still easily available today. Some people even claim that they improve memory and sleep quality. Research has shown that fidget toys allow children with autism, ADHD, and other sensory processing disorders to improve their focus and concentration by giving them a channel through which they can discharge nervous energy and extraneous movements. These therapeutic benefits are real, and I'm not questioning them in any way. But what about the rest of us? I think we could all admit that we have our own habits for releasing nervous energy and calming our anxiety. Anyone repeatedly click a pen or play with a paperclip during a tense meeting? How about twiddling your thumbs? It's human nature. What if we traded our fidget toys and stress balls for a small crucifix to stroke as a reminder of God's presence? And what if these crosses were hanging from beads like a rosary? Such objects of piety might just yield the same calming effects as spinners and worry stones, while at the same time tuning our minds toward God, the only real and lasting source of peace in a frenzied world. A study published in the British Medical Journal found that praying the rosary positively affects heart rhythms and breathing patterns. The rosary seems to provide a simple way to slow respiration, reduce blood pressure, improve concentration, and induce calm. Whether it's the action of fingering the beads or the recitation of re repetitive prayers, I think it's safe to say that the rosary is good for our health. Above and beyond these physical benefits, praying the rosary improves our mental clarity and our ability to control intrusive thoughts. A well-prayed rosary clears our minds of distractions, increases our inner peace, and opens us up to God and others. In a book he wrote about the rosary, Father Benedict Rochelle noted that Protestants are often taken aback by the repetitive nature of the rosary. He notes that prayer beads and repeated phrases or chants are an integral part of most major world religions, with the exception of Protestantism. I found this really interesting, and I think it speaks to how God created us with a unity of body, mind, and soul. By engaging our hands with the beads, our voices with the vocal prayers, and our minds through the meditation on the events of Christ's life, the body and mind are calmed and the soul is freed up to ascend to God. This is the foundation of transformative prayer. Stop.